tonight on Fear Factor. You don't look like normal Fear Factor contestants, man. You know, you guys got six packs, we got kegs. Contestants who break the mold. He's my lover. And break through a whole lot more. And stay tuned for another Capital One Fear Factor home invasion. Every week, Joe Rogan may be in your neighborhood, ready to bring Fear Factor to your door. What's up? I'm Joe Rogan, and this is Fear Factor. The stunts you're about to see were all designed and supervised by trained professionals. They're extremely dangerous and should not be attempted by anyone, anywhere, anytime. Welcome aboard. Thanks. Thank you. Welcome. Hi. Welcome. What's up? What's up? What's up? Hi. How you doing? What's happening? JL. What's up, guys? What's happening, dude? Look, look at you guys. Oh, yeah. Yeah. You don't look like normal Fear Factor contestants, man. You had the right thing with normal. That's normal. correct. Right? You guys look normal, like, like we pulled sure. some dock workers out. <laughs> <laughs> we got two couples each, man. Yeah. All right, man. Well, we welcome you. Welcome aboard, man. And you guys look like fairly normal Fear Factor contestants. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Where are you guys from? Yeah. We're from Texas. Texas, right. Cool. Yeah. And what is your relationship? Best friends, baby. Best friends, cool. What about you guys? What's the relationship? He's my lover. Oh, oh. snap. <laughs> no, he didn't go there. That's it. <laughs> oh, wow. Well, I think that's probably a first. Right on. Yeah. Pioneers. Excellent. What about you guys? Born and raised in Oregon, and we're the twins from Brooklyn. But wait a minute, you're born and raised in Oregon, but you're the Big twins hippies. from Brooklyn? Big hippies. What does that mean? It means that we were born and raised in a teepee. We got raised with boas, and okay. we have a rafting company, and now we live in Brooklyn. Okay, but you're claiming Brooklyn, but you're we born and raised in Oregon? Oh, we love you can't just claim Brooklyn. Brooklyn like that. It's not that easy. No, Six Brooklyn. years? Six years? Yeah. Pushing it. Uh, borderline, borderline, borderline. If you win the show, borderline. we'll let you slide. Thank okay. you. Thank you. So gracious. They ain't going to win the show. Sorry. Well, here's the deal. You four teams have been brought here from all over the country for one reason, to stare fear in the eye as you compete for $50,000. Yeah. Yeah. Ready to see your first stunt? Yeah. All right, here it is. One of you will be stuck into that cannon while your partner is hanging from a crane as it barrels down the pier. The person hanging from the crane is going to drop down into the water and swim over that buoy where they will retrieve two flares. They will then make their way over to the fuse, light the fuse on the cannon, blowing their partner into the water. The partner will then swim over to that ultra boat and plant a flag for time. Ah! That's incredible! Get in. oh. The team that completes this stunt the fastest will get to choose who they want to send home. We have randomly selected today's order, and Wes and Richie, you guys are lucky number one. Right on. So, uh, do you guys work out? Do you exercise? What do you do? Uh, yeah. We're professional dancers. Professional dancers? Broadway. Really? Yeah. Any big shows you've been in? We did Saturday Night Fever on Broadway. Cool. Yeah, 42nd Street. A little, yeah. little bit of that. A did you do a little bit of that? So, how long have you guys been together? Four years. Four years. Have you guys ever done anything together competitively? Played in a softball game? Anything no, for you? Softball. Trying to be a Broadway dancer is competitive enough. That's, is it? <laughs> yeah, that's just, uh, yeah. You guys can relate, right? Oh, yeah. Yeah, we can sure. Relate big time. Yeah. Is, what do you think that dancing is like feminine? Is that what you're trying hey, to say? Hey, I dance all the time for my wife, so that's cool. Do you? you know? Yeah. Can you show us some of your moves? Yeah, show give me a little music. Moves. Bring okay, it. Anybody can do a beat yeah. Give me a da da Give me a da 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 Come on, let's give them Vogue. Oh, wow. <laughs> Got some vogue -ing. All right, you guys ready to do this? Yeah, let's bring do it. it. Who's going in the cannon, and who's going to be on the crane? I'm going in the cannon. Best time to send someone home today? Good luck, gentlemen. Ah! Step on it. Woo! Have fun. Right. Have fun. Woo! Have fun. This is crazy. You're going to be shot out of the cannon. <laughs> okay. This is crazy. Okay. Oh, God. <laughs> 
So I guess we're the first gay couple on Fear Factor. We're going out there, we're gonna kick some major butt. We're pioneers. I mean, I never knew that there wasn't a gay couple on Fear Factor. We're, we're the Ellen of Fear Factor. Who knew, I mean, this is in a cannon. Being dancers, it's hard, so maybe being shot out of a cannon could be harder than ballet. All right, Wes is in the cannon, Richie is hanging from the crane. All right, here he goes. Time starts when he hits the water, time stops when the flag is planted. If he drops early while that arm is swinging out, he's got a much longer swim. He's got to hang on. All right, he's closing in on it. He's hanging in there, but this is a long time suspending. I don't know if everybody's going to be able to do this. Hit, Frankie. All right, he dropped. That was really good. All right, he's got to grab the two flares. He's got the flares. Now he's going to swim over to the deck and light the fuse for the cannon. He was holding on, hanging yeah, for a long no time. Yeah, no problem, and he's still going. Yeah, he's doing really well. Wow, he's got to take <laughs> All right, he made it to the ladder. He's exhausted. He's pulling himself up. It's hard, but he's doing it. All right, now he's got to light the fuse. Hey, what? He's lighting it. All right, here it goes. Whoa! Whoa! That's incredible! That was awesome. That was awesome. <laughs> All right, he's swimming over to the ultra boat. He's got to plant that flag to stop the time. Oh, he slipped. That could cost him. Here he comes. Time! That was great, Wes. Woo! Back it off. Woo -hoo! One minute, nine seconds. Woo-hoo! Wes, Richie, congratulations. Whoa. Welcome back. Good Can job, get gentlemen. Woo -woo. You get a woo woo. Yes, yeah. you may. It's get amazing. A woo -woo. One minute, nine seconds. Nice. Excellent. Very yeah. good job. All right. okay. What was it like getting shot through the cannon? It's scary. Scary? Yeah. Was blind. It? Completely blind. I didn't know what was going on. Yeah, completely blind. But can hit you go hit the water and swim? Here we go. All right, Spanky and Jim, you guys are up next. Oh yeah. You know, yep. I gotta be honest with you, you're not the most athletic looking Aww. gentleman we've ever had on the show. Yeah. Look at these guns. You right. know, you guys got six packs. We right. got kegs. Bro. Buoyancy, buoyancy. Good to be in the water. <laughs> so uh, who's gonna be in the cannon and who's gonna be hanging? From I'm the going crane? out of the cannon. You're going out of the cannon. Yeah. Yeah. And have you had any experience with cannons before? 78, 79. I did run away to the circus. You ran away to the circus. And there happened to be a cannon there. The guys had a good time all the time, stuffing me in the cannon and joking around. So I have a little experience. So that's why you're going to go in the cannon? That's why I'm going in the cannon. Nice. Full circle. Going in the cannon. All right, gentlemen, good luck. OK. Nice luck, well. Joe. Nice guys. Thank you. Thanks. Never in a million years. <sighs> they did good. I know. They, they did, did real good. Uh, I'll get to the boat as fast as I can and clip the thing on, and we go for it. Like we do everything else, right? Okay. <laughs> Unbelievable, bro. Okay, good. What do you think? What do you guys think? If he, if he can get out of the cannon, that's great. That's great. Yeah, you don't yeah. think? I don't know. I don't They're know. They're going to have to get a shoehorn to get him in there. <laughs> I might have to butter him up. Butter him up. We're old and we're gruff. We're not young and buff. We understand that. We're out here to have a great time. And to show that, uh, you know, over 40-something, we can still participate with the young kids. We're not regular guys. We're bikers. We're gonna win. W-I-N. Win. Go. Me and Jimmy the Marine, there'll be no stopping us. So what do you think of Spanky Speedos? Hot. They're hot. Yeah, they're hot. Yeah, really? Yeah, they're Fear factor. To go. Yeah! All right, here we go. The time to beat is one minute, nine Woo! seconds. Remember, the team with the fastest time gets to send home whoever they want. Let's see how long Jim can hang on. He's carrying a lot more weight than Richie. Oh, thanks. Jim's hanging it all the way. Let's see if he's got the arm strength to swim after this. And he's dropping. Perfect! He's in the water. Nice. Whoa. All right, Jim whoa. made it to the buoy. Jim looks like a quick swimmer. He's got the flares. Now he's swimming to the deck. Not that great of a swimmer. It's not that bad. Look, he's not in great shape, but he's not a bad swimmer. All right, he made it to the 
dock. He's got to climb up that rope. He's going to be exhausted. He's exhausted. He's really struggling here. He threw the flares up on the dock. He's having a hard time getting up, though. He's really battling. Look at this. Come Whoa. on. Come on. All right, he made it up. He's got the flare. Oh, he can't even stand up. He's so tired. He's got to light the flare, spark the fuse. <laughs> All right, here goes Becky. All right, here goes. Here comes Becky. Yeah. All right, here comes Becky. So, Richie and Wes, congratulations. You guys are still in the lead. Thanks. Hold on, hold on. Best time, which looks to be the minute nine from the guys who dance. They're going to take out the team that has a factor against them, get it to be a factor. So, maybe, being that we're the old guys, they'll leave us in to the end. You never know. Thank you. We did, Jim. We did good. Okay. Don't be nervous. You're fine. Dude. No, you're gonna be just fine. Do you fine. see all that smoke? I'm I freaking know. out a little bit. I'm Don't, freaking out baby, a little bit. Hey, look at me. Okay. Fifty thousand dollars. This is you're never ever gonna be shot out of never. a cannon ever again. Yeah, yeah so that's don't cool, be scared. Right? This is gonna be bad ass. Okay. I'm not worried about this at all. Me and Birdie have known each other since we were in sixth grade. There's no doubt in my mind that we have this, and I'm not worried about it at all. Casey and I are up against a couple of overweight bikers two gay guys and some weirdo hippies. So I think that we can beat this freak show, no problem. We're bringing it home, baby. All right, Casey is loaded into the cannon. Brodeen is ready to hang from the crane. Their time to beat is one minute and nine seconds. Here they go. to the cannon. Brodeen is ready to hang from the crane. Their time to beat is one minute and nine seconds. Here they go. Brodeen's got to drop down into the water, grab those flares, and make her way over to light the fuse. It's going to blast Casey out of the cannon. Then Casey's got to swim over to that ultra boat and plant the flag to stop the clock. Time starts now. She's in the water. Here she goes. Looks like a strong swimmer. She got to the flares really quickly. All right, now she's swimming over to the deck. She's gonna light the fuse. I think she can get up. All right, she got to the ladder. She's exhausted. She got the flares up there. She's using her legs to pull herself up. Right, Very smart. Go. Go. Very smart. She didn't just use her arms. She's up. That was pretty quick. That was Nine seconds fast than us, feeling good. You're feeling good about your time? Yeah. You got beat by dancers and chicks, and you're feeling good about your time? <laughs> Brodine and Casey, for me, they are the typical fear factor. And this is not a typical fear factor. Brodine and Casey do not belong here, and they need to go bye-bye. We have 109 to beat, so we'll see what's going on. I hope we do well. 
Here we go. I'm ready. All right, this is it. Here we go. Here we go. All right, she's off. This is it. Oh, 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 she's swinging, though. She's swinging hard. A, a big gust of wind just took her. Wow, that's hard. That's hard to hang in there. All right, here she goes. Time starts now. She is in the water. Swimming over to the flares. She's got the flares fairly quickly. She's going to get them out. She's got them. All right, she is headed to the deck. All right, she has made it to the deck, but she's nowhere near the ladder. We're good. That's not good. That is not good. Big mistake. Oh, she had to swim all the way around to the ladder. That was a big screw up. That's going to cost her precious seconds. She's struggling to get up. She's got to use her legs. Rodine used her legs. Very smart. That's right, baby. All right, she's up. She looks exhausted. She's having trouble lighting it. That's going to cost her precious time. Wes and Richie, we might be trying to stop celebrate. Go to the second flare. Woo! Woo! Dakota is in the water. Oh, the oh, oh, it hurts. Oh, it hurts. Oh, oh, no. All right, she has made it to the boat. Did she slip climbing up? No, she's in. She's got the flag. so far. Yeah, so congratulations, Wes and Richie. You guys have the best time. Good swimming. Congratulations, Spanky and Jim. You didn't get beat by all the girls. Congrats, baby. Well, maybe they like us so much they'll keep us around. I don't know. Maybe not. I don't know, maybe. All right, Rich and Wes, Woo! why don't you guys get together and uh, decide who you're going to send home to? Can we send ourselves home? What? <laughs> <laughs> Can we send home? We have to eat pugs tomorrow. <laughs> I don't know. They're all good. When, yeah, uh, I, the twins, they the twins the freak twins. me out anyways. Twins? You know, and being twins, it's kind of weird. But uh, I don't know. They're the twins good. are like, they want to eat anything. Yeah, but Spanky and uh, they could eat and things Jim, too. They, could eat they things like too. They, <laughs> they could totally be into eating Can we go home? No. No, no we're going home. <laughs> OK. Somewhere in America. Could it be at your front door? Wes and Richie, welcome back. <laughs> Rooney and Dakota. Hey! Way to go. All right, Wes and Richie, ah. you guys had to decide who is going home. Yeah. 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 Who's going home? Well. <laughs> Brodine and Casey had, uh, you know, the best time close to us, but. I think we're just going to keep it fair and keep it whoever had the lowest time, which was really? Rooney and Dakota. Oh, sorry, I'm ladies. Sorry, Don't guys. take it personally. I'm sorry. I thought I was like, oh, my gosh. All right. Well, it was really nice meeting you guys. Thank sorry. you. Take it easy. Bye, ladies. Bye. 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 See ya. Sorry about that. Uh, <laughs> I was like, oh, my God. Heart <laughs> attack. This was the best experience. Ooh. This is the one thing for us that we can truly say that we did it together and it really cemented our union and that's more than we expected. I pretty much think the reason why we did get kicked off is because we do like creepy crawlies and snakes and spiders. If you like creepy crawlies, do not open up your mouth. All right, congratulations to the rest of you for making it to the next round. Yay! Second chance. Come with me and we'll see what we have in store for you guys tomorrow. Oh, tomorrow. God. oh God. Oh, God. Oh, God.
gentlemen. Uh, I love the jackets. It's a JR. A very it's sporty happening. look. What's up? Good. You guys ready to see your next stunt? Yes. Ready. Go for it. Here Fight. is your next stunt. Uh-oh. Buckle up. Uh, you are each going to have to dive into those dumpsters and barrels that are filled with oil, mud, lard, and rotten fish parts. You and your partner are going to have to match up four of the eight possible items that are submerged in the dumpsters and in the barrels. Those items are two gas cans, two baseball gloves, two thermoses, a pair of boots, a pair of hard hats, two toasters, two radios, and two tin cans. The good news is no one is going to be eliminated today. Yeah. 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 Instead, whichever team can match four of the eight items the fastest will win a four-night, all-inclusive stay to Las Vegas, Nevada. Yeah, Vegas, baby! Where you'll enjoy luxurious spas, fine dining, shows, and to make it even more exciting, Las Vegas is also giving you $20,000 to spend while you're there. Yeah! So a four-night okay, so trip oh in Vegas and $20,000 is on the line. Right. Yeah. Now we have randomly selected today's order. Spanky and Jim, you guys are lucky number one. And what do you, what do you guys think about the stunt? It's like swimming in the East River. Uh, yeah, bad yeah. stuff in there. Time to get nice. dirty. Nice. Gentlemen, good luck. Nice. All right, predictions. What's gonna happen? They're gonna dive right in there. They're dive yeah, right in they there. don't seem like they're afraid yeah, of getting no, dirty, no, right? No, they're not afraid yeah. to get dirty. All right, gentlemen, you ready to do this? Ready? In three, two, one, go! All right, Jim is in the oil. Oh, he is covered in oil. Spanky is going in the dumpster. They gotta unscrew whatever is at the bottom of that barrel. Whoa! Gas can! Gas can! Spanky's got a gas can. Spanky's got a gas can and a hard hat. He's got a hard hat. We have a match. You got a hard hat and a gas can. Uh, what is that other thing? That looks like a dog food ball. I don't think that's go. The hat is a match. That dog bowl is nothing. The smell is atrocious. I got a shoe. He got a shoe. Spanky looks very much at home in that dumpster. What do you got there? Gas can. No, toaster. You got a toaster. Spanky, if you find a toaster, you got a match. Shoe. He's got a shoe as well. That's not a finger. That's not a finger. Dog thing. Get the dog thing out of there. So far, you got hard hats, you got toasters, and you got boots. Damn it. Damn it. Thermos, you got the thermos. Get your thermos. Time. That's it. Who's the man? The man. That's the man. The man. Spanky and Jim, right. welcome back. Now, when you guys had to go in the barrels and retrieve those items, you know that you had to unscrew the things and then pull them out, right? Yeah. All the things that are in those barrels are all connected down with a bolt, and you have to unscrew the bolt. Then once you get it off, then you take the items out. You didn't do that. What you did do is you yanked them, and you broke all these key rings. Jimmy, I didn't know you were that strong. <laughs> Jimmy's an animal. Unfortunately, your time doesn't mean anything, because you guys are disqualified from this event. You didn't okay. follow the rules. The all good right. news is we're you're still eliminated. running for $50,000. No. You're not eliminated from okay. the show. We but take it like men. You are out of the running for the trip to Vegas and the twenty thousand dollars. Okay. Wes and Richie, what do you guys think about this? We are gonna do our best. Yeah. 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 Ready? Hopefully. Good luck, Joe. Good, good luck, guys. Way to go. Remember, this is for four nights in Las Vegas and twenty thousand dollars. In three, two, one, go. All right, here they go, both in the dumpsters at the same time. No hesitation, searching around for objects. Okay, they got a gas can. Glove. Got a glove, got a helmet. Gas can, glove, helmet, boot, and a thermos. Here they go. They're taking a little more dainty approach. Oh, now he's going ahead first. You kind of have to, right? You have to commit yeah, to it. Okay, you got a helmet. They're moving slow. 
Okay, so you guys so far, you have a helmet and you have a shoe. You matched up two, you need two more. Coming up on three minutes, guys, let's go! Four minutes, 45 seconds! Come on, guys! On the barrel so far, they have matched up the boots. The other helmet is on the floor. Vegas got this, right? Oh my God. Yeah, Vegas, we're going to Vegas, baby. 20 grand. All right, gas can. Put them up on the trash can and put the helmet that's on the, tr on the, on the ground, too. There's a helmet on the ground. Pick it up and put it in the trash can. There you go. You have three matched up so far. You need one more thing. That's it. They have two helmets, two boots, and two gas cans. They need one more item to match, either a thermos or the glove. Got it. You got a glove. Time. Good work. Seven minutes and 13 seconds. Okay. Ladies, you ready to do this? We're ready. All right, ladies, here we go. In three, two, one, go! Liz, you ready to do this? We're ready. Time to beat is seven minutes and 13 seconds. If you can beat that, you will be on your way to Vegas with $20,000. If not, it all goes to Wes and Richie. Mm -hmm. All right, ladies, here we go. In three, two, one, go! All right, they're up and they're in the dumpster. Right in. They got a helmet. Gas can. They got a gas can. They got a boot. Toaster! Diving into the mud now. Thermos. You got a helmet, a boot, a gas can, and a toaster. Whoa. Oh, Dean's manhandled her. See that? Casey, you gotta be more aggressive. Let's go. Wes and Richie are already booking their tickets for Celine Dion. <laughs> Hold your breath and go in! Five minutes. These guys are a minute and 30 seconds away from Vegas. Six minutes and 30 seconds. You guys have 45 seconds. You can still do this. Ten seconds. Nine. Richie, congratulations. You guys have won a trip for four to Las Vegas for four nights plus $20,000. Congratulations. Now let's go grab the ladies and see what we have in store for you guys tomorrow. Come on, cool. Come on, ladies. Let's get out of here and clean you up. Congratulations to you all for making it to the final stop. Yeah. And of 
course, a big congratulations to Wes and Richie for winning their second stunt in a row. Here is your final stunt. As that helicopter flies above, it will be dragging you and your partner on your stomach across this asphalt. Along the way, you'll be smashing through exploding walls and barrels. When you break through your final obstacle, you will let go and see how close you can get to the finish line. Whichever team can get closest to the finish line will become Fear Factor champions and win $50,000. We have randomly selected today's order. And Jim and Spanky, yeah, once again, go, you are yeah. lucky number one. Just so you guys understand, is your combined total distance to the line that will count up. Ready okay. to do this? Ready. Gentlemen, Absolutely. go put on your leathers and good luck to you. Thank you. Thank you. They might forget to let go and just keep riding. Right? <laughs> they might just, Do that. They, they might like just it. enjoy the ride. They They're not like here it. for the cash. They're just here for a good time. They could just be like, yeah! I know. <laughs> All right, Spank. Hey, Jimmy. This is now, it. This is us. <laughs> <laughs> if it's anything else, how is a ballerina going to hold on to that thing? How are the cheerleaders going to do that? Let's do it. Okay, ready. <laughs> and this is Brian. And we met huh? 10 months ago tomorrow on, on Match.com. Match. Oh. Looking for a real relationship? Text free to 55702 and Match will give you seven days free. And we are so happy and thrilled. So thank you, <laughs> Match.com. You made my life come true. Text free to 55702 and get seven days free. Join. You'll change your life forever. Why wait to meet someone great? Text free to 55702 and get your seven days free on Match now. We are here in Dubuque, Iowa, right on the Mississippi River for another Capital One Fear Factor home invasion. Maybe we're coming to your house. <laughs> All right, Jim is in the red leather, Spanky is in the black. We are ready to get dragged across the pavement behind a helicopter. And here we go. All right, this is it, they're off. But Jimmy, I love him. Jimmy is the man right now. Yesterday, he got disqualified. Today, he made up for it. Now, it was my fault today. Welcome hey. back, Spanky and Jim. Nice job. Good job. 43 Good job. feet, 6 inches was your total. And it was mm. all Spanky. Jim, you stopped dead on the yeah. line. Yep. How the hell did you nice. do that? Um, I was going to eat pavement, whatever I had to do to make up for last night. He John. did. He did. Yeah, you, did. you awesome. dug in, man. You stopped dead on the line. What do you think, Spanky? I, I didn't like it. I didn't like it. I'd rather ride a bike and jump 14 cars and do that, and I did not like it. 
Yeah. All right. Wes and Richie, Ooh. what do you think? I'm scared. Oh You're scared? Yeah, I'm scared. How scared? Super oh, scared. Super scared. Super, oh, super scared? Super scared. Super scared. Super scared. Uh, now, what are you scared of? Well, Dying. that. Explosion, <laughs> scraping. Well, you know, Spanky's a tough guy. And for Spanky and Jim, they're both tough guys. Look, you could be say, trying to psych you out. They could. You know? They could. Okay. But, you know, we're still going to go through with it, so. All right. Sounds good. Good luck. All right. Yeah. See ya. You think they're going to be able to beat you guys? They get a chance. They got, a chance. they got a 43 foot uh, play. Give or take, yeah. Just to point out, we measure in either direction. So if they fall short or go long, it's the combined distance exactly. from the line. All right, West is in black, Richie is in red. They are suited up and ready to go. All right, they're off. Here we go. He stopped way short. He let go early. It's looking good for Jim and Spanky. Wes, how did? Well, the good news is those guys won 20 grand on a trip to Vegas. The bad news is it's over for them. They're done. That's not bad news. That's good no, news, Joe. That's yeah. I'm so glad that I did it with Richie. I would never want to do it with anybody else. He's my complete support system. I'm so glad Wes and I could share this experience. We had such a great time. Fear is not a factor. No, we can't say that because it was. We lost. Bro, Dean and Casey, this is it. It's down to you guys. I know. What do you think? I'm excited. You, you know what you have to do now? Do you guys think you have a little bit of an advantage watching two people do it? Watching Jim do it perfectly, watching Wes make a big mistake. Yeah, anything I can to stay as close to the line as possible. Just, just be on the line. <laughs> My teeth, whatever. I don't Your teeth? You're crazy. <laughs> crazy. Your combined distance from the line has to be less than 43 feet, six inches. If you guys beat that, you win $50,000. If not, it all goes to Spanky and Jim. You ready? Yes. yes. Good luck, ladies. Good luck. Good luck, girls. Good luck. All right, gentlemen, what do you think? We want that 50000 to go to New York, and me and Jimmy are going to build two custom choppers in the winter. Do the winter. All right, man, all right, relax. It's going to be I'm a relax. All right, here we go. Helicopter's firing up. Girls are in position. Rosine is close to us. Casey is on the outside. I think they won. I don't think we won either. I think they won. I think they won. All right, we gotta get a measurement. I think they got it. Son of a... All right, well... Heart's beating, man. At least the ballerinas, if we lose, at least the ballerinas didn't beat us. I don't know, man. Casey's pretty close to the line. Neither one of them is dead on it like Jim, but Spanky went pretty far. We'll see if they're closer than 43 feet, six inches. That means if, still, if they wait for them to come back, we don't win. You know that, right? Yep. That's what's gonna happen, so I already have a feeling already. Damn it. Ah, eh, we had fun. Way to go, girls. All right, go, bro, Dean and Casey, way. how do you feel you did? Not good enough. No, not good. Jim, you got disqualified yesterday, but you nailed it today. Their distance was 101 feet. Yeah! You guys just won $50,000. Congratulations. Congratulations. And evidently fear is not a factor for you guys. Congrats. Yeah, 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 yeah
across America. Joe Rogan and his own invasion crew make a family face their fears as they attempt a stunt in their very own home. All right, we are here in Dubuque, Iowa for another Capital One Fear Factor home invasion. And we are about to sneak up on the Whitmans. They think they have what it takes to win some money. Let's see if they do. Ooh. Oh, no. Hello? Hi. Hey. What's going on? We're waiting for Fear Factor. Oh, my god, Fear Factor is <laughs> here. Come on outside. Hi. Right oh, now. Right now. Oh, my god. Oh, my god. <laughs> No, it's right yeah, now. It's Come on. It's later. You know, what, what makes you think that you guys have what it takes to do Fear Factor stunts? We're athletes. We're, we're athletes. athletes. Yeah, we're yeah. athletes. How's your stomach? Oh, yeah. Yeah. We haven't eaten pretty strong? Yeah. Pretty strong? Yeah. Well, you haven't eaten in a while? No, we're hungry. No. All right, Gary, Lisa, and Tammy, this oh. is what we have in store for you guys. Oh. Oh. <laughs> this is for a Capital One credit card worth $5,000. And what we're going to do is we're going to make some worm wine. <laughs> this is going to be a full family stunt here, all right? Mom, what you're going to do is you're going to pick up the worms and dump them into here. Dad, you're going to grind these up. Uh-oh. Oh. Don't cry. Don't... And Tammy, <laughs> you're going to have to drink it. Oh, my God. Tammy, Tammy oh, as soon as the worm wine hits that line, you're going to start sucking it down. Just down it. You I'm can do it. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Look at it. Do it for your family. Do it for the family. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. All right, here we go. In three, two, one, go. Go, go, go. 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 All right, get in there. Go. Grind it up. Dad's got it. Put yeah. Put it down. 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 Put it Go!